My peoples, what's going on? Listen, quick tutorial on how to work this bot and inside the Telegram um, group chat there on the link side. All right. <clears throat> so this bot is connected to the link side of the of the bot of the of the network. So anytime you post, you're gonna go to the bot. Always from the bot, it goes to the group um, link side. All right. So when you first come in, when you first become a member. And you go into the bot, it's first going to prompt you for seven questions. Your name, your email, your secondary skill, your first, uh, like if you're a singer, if you're a rapper, if you're a producer, if you have any secondary skills, if you do logos, stuff like that. It's going to ask you some of those questions. After you finish those questions, at that point, then it's going to prompt you to this screen right here at the bottom where it says add link. Mine, because I'm, I'm the, the main person, I guess, it has that admin panel where I can actually add the, the questions or whatever, take away questions. On yours, it'll only say stats and add link, which is all you need. So there's three th steps here and how you, this works. So let's break this down. So you're gonna you're, you're in the bot. You're about to post your link. You come to the bot. Real quick, let's go back out. So you see how I've pinned the network links, the network bot, and the network talk all at the top. The way you pin, if you don't know how to pin, you hold, let's say I wanted to pin Patriot Party Chat. I'm going to press it and hold it. At that point in the very top right-hand corner, you're going to see uh, a speaker, a file, a trash. On mine, I got to hit those three dots. On yours, it might just be there. A pin might be right at the very top. So I'm going to go to the three dots. There's the pin. If I hit pin, it puts party uh, Patriot Party at the top, as you can see. To unpin it, very simple, press and hold. For me, it's the three buttons, unpin, now he's out of there. So that's the way you pin him. You want to pin the network links, the network talk, and the network box at the top. That way you always, it's very easily to get. Now, if I want to make a leave a link, I go to the network bot. Let's go to network bot, number two. It's going to prompt this screen right here where it says add links or stats. We're going to get into the stats a little bit later. Add link. Let's touch it. First thing is going to ask you if you if if there's links that you haven't hit yet, it's going to prompt you to hit the 10 links. If there's only three or if there's only five links from the time that you last came in, it's only going to have you do the three or the five or the seven, whatever the number. But if there's 10, you'll have to hit the 10. So let's go through the motions. Visit link. We're going to see exactly how long it takes us right now to hit these links. So visit link. Let's open the first one. I'm going to like it. I'm going to comment, which I already done. So we can actually stop it. Let's bring her down. Let's get out of here. As you can see now, it's saying, oh, it's only one. It was only one link. So it's, it's already allowing me to post my link. If there was 10, you would have to do 10 of them. So in this case, it, it, it almost, it, the bot is full to think that there's 10 because there's no other link. So, Let's say you're at this point. You hit your 10 likes. You hit your 10 comments. You hit your 10 links. Now you're at this point. The first thing it's going to ask you to install a link is to decorate it. That's number one out of three things. So the first one is to decorate it. What does that mean? The decoration is going to be what people are going to look at once it leaves here, the bot, and it goes to the group chat. This is what they're going to see. So what you want to do is if you're going to YouTube, if you're going to Instagram, or wherever you're going, Whatever air, whatever uh, link you're going to get, take a picture or a screenshot of the link itself so that you can decorate it. That's the first step. So let's do it. I'm going to go to YouTube. Let's go to Evelyn. There's her video yes, right there. I'm going to, oh, I'm going to take a screenshot. So at that point, I come back out to my Telegram. Let me take, let me leave the screenshot. There it is at the top. So now, once I put that in the telegram, it's going to prompt me to leave a button. Number two, you got to leave a button, guys. All right. So edit buttons. Let's touch that. It's click an existing button or delete it. So we're going to add one, right? We don't have any buttons yet. So we want to add a button. A button, all it's doing is a description of the link itself. So let's hit the plus sign. It's going to prompt you. Please enter the button text. So Evelyn, Eve. YouTube. Just a description of the of what you're, they're going to look at. Once I send that, it's going to ask for the URL. Let's go back out. Let's go to YouTube. Let's get the URL. And now, 
Let's paste the URL. There it is. It's pasted. Now let's send it. At that point, we hit this button. We're almost there. Now, if you had another link, guys, let's say you wanted to send your Instagram link at the same time you wanted to do your YouTube, you can actually add another link. It won't add a picture. It'll use the same picture that you already added, the first one, but it will add the secondary Instagram link for you, all right? So now let's hit back since we're not going to do that. Let's just hit back. At this point, all you want to do now is before you finish an adding, which will send it to the group, you want to preview it to see how it's going to look at the group. Let's hit preview. At this point, you're seeing right here what it's going to look like. All right, it's going to be a pic the screenshot of, the, of where you're going to go, the button at the bottom, which is Eve YouTube. That's where it's going to send you at. And that's basically how it's going to look in the group when it sends it over there. So at this point, we're done. Finish adding. That's all we got to do is hit finish adding. Once you hit that button, it will send it from the bot to the group. Here we go. And there you hear it. So now let's go back out. Let's go to the part, the network links. There it is right there. And there you go. There's the screenshot and there's the button. If you hit the button, it'll open up the, the uh, site. And there she is. All right. So let's go back out. Let's go to Telegram. So now if you want to see what your link is doing, you, you, sent the, you put a link in there. You want to see what your link is doing. Go right back to the bot. Let's go to network bot. Let's say the link was this one right here, because I've posted it a couple of times, but let's say I wanted this particular one right here. So I'm going to hit the EV, EV YouTube button. As you can see there, it's going to tell me the link, the, the YouTube, uh, NRS, APF, DJ, all those long numbers. All I do is I remember after YouTube and the backslash, I remember the first three, NRS. NRS. Okay, so we're going to remember NRS. So now when you go to stats at the bottom and you click stats, it's going to have all everybody's links. So all you're doing is you're going to YouTube and you're looking for NRS. NRS. Where's it at? All right, let's go back. You see how there's another arrow because there's already a lot of links in here. YouTube NRS. It's still not here. Let's go another one. There, it's at the very bottom one. It's the very last one. You see our YouTube NRS? So if I was to click that one, it will tell me there how many people clicked on it. Clicks, only one click because I was the only guy. It'll tell you the last click. It happened that day, which is today. And it'll tell you the time that it happened, 819 in military time. And that's basically it. That's basically it, guys. That's the way you add links and that's the way you have to comment and like the links before you even leave your link. Let me go back out. Is there anything else? I think that's all of it. If you have any questions, reach out. But every link has to go through the bot itself. Just to reiterate, you have to go through the bot to leave the link. If there's a random link, because right now you can still leave links. If you just go to the network links and leave a link there, it'll, it'll take it. But I will delete it. If it doesn't have a button, it, is, it doesn't come from the bot. I'll know it because it doesn't have a button. And then we'll delete it. Eventually, I'll have a bot in there that will do that automatically. That anybody who leaves just a random link, it will get deleted automatically. You have to go through the bot um, so that the bot can create that link that it could track. And then that way we know everybody's liking and commenting. All right? This is professional now, guys. Now we're keeping it honest. Now we know that every, everybody who's in here working this and leaving links has to leave... 10 likes and, and comments before they can even leave their link. So you know that they're, they're doing it. It's not like some, like it is right now, where there's probably like 10% doing it and the other 90 are not doing it or they're doing it whenever they want. And then the 10% that are doing it, they're saying, why aren't those guys doing it? And why am I doing it? And so now it, it creates this riffle. We're, we're ending that right now with this. By now you knowing that in order to leave a link, you have to do 10. So everybody's in the same boat. Um, and there is no way of getting around it. All right, guys, any questions, y'all feel free, reach out, but this is all of it. God bless you guys. Have fun with it. Practice with it. Put some links out. Before we start recruiting, let's start sending some links ourselves, and let's start playing with it ourselves And then this weekend. And that way we can get this hashed out, we know, and then that way we can teach the other ones that are coming in, and we can teach them. All right, guys.